I'm highly disappointed. Thank you for doing the class. What am I doing? Tap, tap. <laughs> Let's get into this. Wow. <laughs> I'm really a mother out here. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It's your girl, Bad Tammy, and this is a new weekly vlog. If you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and do all that good stuff. And I'm actually going to put you guys in an actual vlog. I just wanted to come and say hey and look a little presentable because I was starting this off looking a little raggedy and bust down. And with that being said, let's go ahead and get into this vlog. Hey y'all, so we are about to be getting ready to go to the movies tonight. We're supposed to be going to the movies at 7. It's currently 4. So I have about like 2 hours and a half to like get dressed or whatever. We're going to watch the new um Tiana 1001 movie. So I just wanted to get ready with you guys. So I feel like I don't really do it as much. I wanted to do like a ponytail but I don't have any hair and I don't want to run out to the store. So I'm just going to do a braid it one i want to have like a braid in the middle so that's what i'm sectioning off right now you guys probably already seen the hairstyle by now though um don't mind my armpit hairs y'all was supposed to go get waxed up yesterday but she was like super busy and i didn't feel like waiting in there so we'll probably do that sometime this week but i'm really excited to watch this movie the trailer was given And I just have like high hopes for like Tiana. So I honestly think it's gonna be bomb. So this is what it looks like, but I don't think I like it, so I'm gonna retry it. Alright, we about to try this again. It'd be the front. I got like a weird <laughs> hairline. I wish I knew how to braid like stitch. I'm about to retry it. <laughs> I think it's because it's been so long since I actually braided my hair. Yeah. So I try to section it off like how they do the little stitches. Like I already have it separated. Uh, and I think it's sort of working. Oh no. I honestly didn't think it was going to work. So I didn't even section it all the way to the back. So the back is not gonna look like the top up here. So I'm gonna come back when I'm done with the braid, y'all. So the braid is done and now I'm gonna sleek the hair to a ponytail. I already like the braid as much, but I'm not about to sit here and keep playing with it. Cause it's only gonna make me more upset. It made me mad. But that'd be a different type of pain when your hair ain't coming out right. Have you ever um, started crying because your hair ain't <laughs> coming out right? I remember them days. So I'm just sleeking it down with the gel that I use. Alright, so now I'm putting it in the pony. Nice and tight on there. I'm going to be adding hair, of course. I got this one. And I'm only gonna need one, of course, so I'm just gonna attach this under the ponytail. So when you put it on there, you literally wrap it around under your real hair. You always have to leave that little piece out to cover at the end. I'm gonna separate the, the braiding hair in threes and then do that with my real hair as well. So one, two, and three. And then the real hair, same thing. One, two, and three. Then I like to go in with a little bit of the gel at the top. Fall that frizz. So I repeat this step to all of the strands. When that's done, I just go in and braid, of course. So I'm gonna show y'all a little bit. Wow. 
Your hair looks so cute. Mm -hmm. You look so cute and you look like a princess. Mm -hmm. And I'm a princess too? Mm -hmm. Thanks, Mom. You're nice. Mm -hmm. I'm going to three sides. Well, I was going to have the movie. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what we're going to see. Let's see. Y'all, let's do your snacks for what, y'all? You seriously? You think I'm slick? I'm not slick. And that's the food. Alright, y'all, I'm about to finish braiding this off real quick. Alright, so the pony is done, and I'm just putting a rubber band at the end. And I don't be adding to it because I suck at adding hair. I feel like it's so difficult, so I literally just be doing like the length. Or whatever the hair is and then lastly we just you know wrap the extra piece around to cover the hair bow so I like to wrap and then kind of add gel and then when I'm done I also spray um got to be just so it can hold so that's what that looks like and then I'll kind of go in and like spread the pointer a little at the end because I don't like when it has like that dramatic look of like where it's like fat and then it just gets like so skinny out of nowhere at the end so I kind of like fluff it out a little bit all right so this is the final product that's so cute as you guys see it is a little Mommy. stiff I don't really like to dip it because i feel like it takes forever to like dry so anyways we're gonna leave it like this and then i'm gonna just do my edges and probably do a little glam as you guys see we got some acne coming out here so i'm gonna probably come back and check in with you guys um when i figure out what i'm wearing all right y'all so this is my mirrors here i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the fit right here so i have on this green two-piece outfit from pretty little thing if you guys watch my haul then you guys know and then i have it with these purple fours and as you guys see they have like that green detailing so this is the outfit i really love how this looks yeah and i was sitting here rushing because i thought the time said 6 40 but really it said 5 40 so i still have like a whole 30 ish minutes so i like rushed for no reason i have found these press-ons and my stuff so i think i'm gonna go ahead and apply these look how the fingers are looking crusty and then when i'm done i'm gonna head out to zana's dressed as well already so like i said currently it's 5 5 55 look y'all we got angel numbers so i'll just check back in with you guys in a minute movies give it a rate i'm highly disappointed i give it like a four it's like they had the platform and the plan but they just didn't execute nothing happened if you really think about it nothing at all i don't know i'll give it a three i had high hopes from the trailer and you know i watch a lot of movies and it ain't one of that i'm sorry karen karen fell asleep what number you give it Zero because you fell asleep. Cody, what number you give it? I give it a five. It was like no action. Yeah, it was just they was just in the apartment the whole time. My girl Tiana, good actor though. I like the way she act. They just I don't know, it had to be a better um storyline. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it was. Yeah. So we're out. Alright guys, so I am finally home and I just put Tizana in bed. 
because as you guys think she ended up falling asleep it's currently 10 o'clock on a dot so it's pretty early but i'm not gonna do much but lay in bed and just wait on our food to get here i'm pretty much gonna watch something on tv and that's it for this friday night it's a little like uh because it is like a gloomy wet friday today it has been raining a little bit i actually seen this funny post that one of um the fan pages actually made and i just thought it was so funny i'll probably put it on the screen like what's your move for this friday and that's me as fuck i'm literally me in the picture so that's the vibe yeah i'm about to just you know wind down for the night but yeah i don't think i ever showed you guys the press songs this is what they look like just white little Percy's. but the movie y'all i wouldn't say go watch it of course she looked good and the acting was good but i just felt like the movie overall it just wasn't given if y'all um watched it as well let me know in the comments what y'all thought about the movie but other than that i'm about to take like this makeup off and you know call it a night good morning guys i am up and it, it's pouring outside but today is april 1st so that's april fools wondering if i wouldn't be a prankster today but that's not really my vibe i used to hate in like middle school when people used to do that when used to like fake break up with your boyfriend or stuff like that it's currently like 11 and i'm about to do my little core workout for the day i started um doing that workouts at home since like last week just because i feel like it will actually help me get results faster it's just like a quick little workout you know something is better than nothing actually claudia introduced me to this one it's a 60 minute um core workout real intense it's four different workouts and i have to do um four reps of 30 seconds so that's what i'm about to go ahead and do and i just threw on this little workout outfit so this is the workout outfit so this light so i'm about to go ahead and do that i think i'm gonna make this and I'm gonna actually play some music while I do this. Cause I do not want to be hearing some lot of stuff over there. My hands so dirty from counting these cash. I need to sell it I need to clean. I can't afford the rap game up. They say I better lie. I had to show a nigga last night. I'm still got some gunpowder on me right now. Still got some bad news on me. Still got some bad news on me. Give me some time. Purchase drink. Lambo stop. Birds and plank. Say they don't fuck with me. Then cause they can't. And I'm not acting like nothing I ain't. She let me smash what she had my mouth. Top notch bitches on my boat. I'm in their pocket, their ass and toe. Got a new plug to the flush of neighborhood. Switch the soft toe. The label fuck a budget. What budget? I don't fuck with rappers. They too bloody bloody. Real estate. Now my money make it money. Know it tastes good if you see me puff. So I did it for a minute puff. I ain't give her nothing, got the bitch up. Had to tell her what we do it for the puppies. Yeah, they suck to talk to me. Watch my every move if you wanna beat me. Just say that. No, I like her head. She got straight in the car and told me lay back. They want the strength for that exotic. If it's him, I pay that. Say she done, but this bitch toxic. She gon' make her way back. Look, I'ma fuck her, say that. Push me, watch I scoot your face back. I'm a giver, I've been getting it, I know they can't take that surgery. Rather fall back before I fall off, cause of them I stamped it. Oh, no love, but I'm stand on business if it's up, just say that. I treat how I'm moving like this, place it back and watch the pull up. You can't say you smoking your op if you want responsible for it. You can't name my hoe that cut me off or put me on. I wait, I recommend you keep up around, you walk up from your own. Alright, I'm done. And when I tell y'all it's intense, is intense i um, broke a little sweat i'm a little sweaty right here so i'm about to hop in the shower because i'm actually gonna try to go get my wax and my eyebrows done since it is like rainy outside it might be like a little slow or whatever so i'm probably gonna chill for like five minutes calm down and then get in a um shower or whatever and get dressed for the day so I'll just come back and update you guys in a minute. All right, guys, I'm all refreshing up and I'm about to get ready to head out. I'm gonna show you guys my little outfit. Um, I just have on this white top, I think Fashion Nova, green cargos from Pretty Little Thing and the same kicks as yesterday, the purple with the green detailing. So yeah, this is the outfit. And I'm probably just gonna wear my LP because I feel like this is 
a neutral bag the rain is actually gone out and it, it looks like the sun is trying to come back out so that's good but i'm still gonna take my white sweater to throw on just in case so in case i didn't mention i'm about to go get my wax done um i need eyebrows done and i need to get my underarms waxed as well so i'll probably check in with you guys once we arrive to the shop guys so we are done with all of that little self-care things that we need to get done and as you guys seen i tried out the eyebrow tinting and i feel like it, you could definitely see the difference my eyebrows are actually very light and i've always wanted to try it i actually wanted to try it on myself but i had asked her and she was like yeah and she's my eyebrow lady so you know i trust her it's like a difference there but i feel like it's still pretty okay I feel like it looks good. I really like it. What do you guys think? So right now, actually, we're going to go grab us some lunch. So that's where we head at now. I'm pretty much checking with you guys um, once we make it to our destination for um, lunch. So I actually was going to go sit down at a restaurant, but then I thought that I've been craving some Jamaican food. So we're at this Jamaican spot right now. So I always get the jerk chicken, tree light oxtails. Um... And Tazana's gonna try the brown stew chicken because she said that one is actually not spicy. Um, it's still, it's still cooking on the fire. I mean, it's kind of hard. So, that how long do you think it's gonna take? Probably next half an hour. All right, y'all. So, I just picked the food up. I'm ready to eat. So, I'm gonna show you guys the food once we get home. We're home and I'm gonna show you guys the food. So, we got some plantains. Plantains. I love these. It kind of reminds me of like Platano al horno Like the bananas that my mom made Then this is Tazana food The brown stew chicken with rice and peas And cabbage And then this is the Jerk chicken Rice and peas and cabbage It's the same one of mine Yeah I love this I love their jerk chicken It's like the perfect spiciness she actually wanted to get oxtails, but because they had just opened, it was like that it was going to be about like another hour 
or so for the oxtails to be done so he just ended up getting jerk chicken as well so let me um get to zana situated i'm gonna put her in a different like a bigger plate and then i'm gonna come eat with you guys for a minute and i forgot that i did get some lemonade it's so bomb i'm gonna put it in my cup actually Perfect. Let me give y'all the overview. Look at this, y'all. Bomb AF. I really don't even eat in my office. I'm about to try it in here for y'all. Mm -hmm. I haven't had this in a minute. Because every time I crave it, they're closed, which they be closed on Mondays. You know how you be like with Chick-fil-A when you know they close on Sunday, but that's the day you want it the most. I might sit here and eat my food. Hey, y'all. Y'all gonna be mad at me, but literally didn't do nothing yesterday when I got home. We were supposed to go out, but I just ended up saying fuck it and just stay at home. I did end up getting a little tired um, when I ate that food, so I just like laid down and took a nap and then that was it and plus i actually had to wake up real early this morning because i had to take my sister to a nail appointment at seven no at eight in the morning so yeah that's all that happened and today i'm just gonna be chilling because i have to go pick her back up so i'm just like gonna be waiting on her i did do a bit of picking up around here and then actually today we have our makeup class number two with pam so we're learning how to do like a little more glam more like coverage i told you guys i wanted to learn about like covering when my eyes are like much darker and heavier and then we're also going to be learning like eyeshadow that isn't supposed to start till like 3 30 4 ish um we're gonna meet at ota first because you know we gotta pick up on the new products that we might be using and all that good stuff and then we should head to the shop and you know get started with the class so i'm actually really excited for that depending on like how long the class is i think it should probably be like an hour to two hours i'll see if i pick up on something to make dinner because today is sunday so yeah but let's sunday y'all and then i will probably come back and talk to you guys maybe when i'm already dressed up or like when i go pick my sister up or whatever hey guys so it is much later it's currently like three ish i believe but as you guys see i am already refreshing up um i'm just wearing this cute skim set this is her new collection which i actually am gonna do a try on haul for you guys but this is one of the pieces this is the blue color she dropped along with the shorts i'm wearing i actually remember about these shoes that my nail girl got me for my birthday so i'm gonna wear these because they go perfectly just something chill or whatnot and i will come back and check it with you guys once um we meet up with pam at ota hey guys so i'm at ota meeting the girls now and pam says she's actually here already at ota um i didn't even see <laughs> you dye your hair it's cute pam right here actually y'all the new hair color looking cute Right, that's what I said. You just dyed it? Yeah. Here go the girls. That's a giving boo. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yeah. Alright, so we inside got our little baskets. Do I still, I still have moisturizer? Yeah, I still got the same one. Yeah, yeah, like, the still same got one. Moisturizer. Last week we did like everyday makeup. This is like a full So this, like with more makeup, you kind of want something that for it to grip to. Yeah. So, Yeah, that's the one that I got. I You're recently just bought it. Okay. Y'all still got your concealers? Yeah. But you, you guys are using the Born This Way, right? Yeah, Two the Two Face. The only one you want like more bright under eye, you go like two shades down. That's what I was going to say. So yeah. the ones that y'all have now that's is like a natural. natural. So you still will use that one. And it's good because that one's more hydrating. So we can use one of the e.l.f. concealers. This is good. This the stick contour yeah. that I'm going to try out. But we're going to try cream contour as well. No, this is a cream contour. Oh, okay. So what's the other one, the liquid one? They're both the same, but they're in different forms. Oh, okay. So that's why I said, if do you rather try the cream or would you rather try that one? Which liquid? one you think is easier? Probably that one. All right, y'all, we're checking out from Ulta now. And then we're... She haven't rung everything up yet, but it says 67. 
Yeah. What's your total? Well, 18, but mine's is with Oh, yeah. And Karen. Karen. And then we actually going to Sephora because we didn't find some things in here. All right, y'all, we're at Sephora. We're actually in the one that they have in Kohl's. That's the contouring stick. That's the one with the dots. That's the dot one. But we're getting the tart, right? Yeah. We're still trying to find the contour. Yeah, because Ulta didn't have nothing. All right, y'all, we made it to the makeup shop now. And we actually got some roses and a gift card for Pam. Like a little thank you for the makeup class. Like we're going to school like cosmetology school. Yeah, we got makeup bags and a black one. I actually ordered a new one, but I didn't bring up. I got the Louis one. I'm just playing. <laughs> and then we ordered some food from here, but they talking about 30 minutes. So I'm going to check in with you guys once we make it in. Oh, we got you a little something for thank you for doing Aww. the class. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we made it yeah. to... Cam Studio. I'm gonna show y'all the new things that we got. I'm gonna show you guys the stuff from Ulta first. So I picked up on some lashes because, as you guys see, I don't got the extensions. I needed some new sponges. We got this Real Techniques brush. Which one is this one for? Contour? I mean, or concealer. Concealer. Y'all know how y'all don't want to use the sponge? Well, y'all yeah. want to have more coverage from your concealer. That brush will give you more. Primer. By Elf. I got this new blush from ColourPop. So cute. This is Perry Air. I got the Black Girl Sunscreen. We got some new concealer from Elf. We got this Morphe brush, the M439 for foundation. And I spent $94.12 at Elf. And then from Sephora, we didn't find nothing in both of the ones that we went. Well, what we was looking for. So we got this Refi. Refi. Refi brush. This is a foundation brush as well. And then we got the Rare Beauty bronzer stick. Sephora total was fifty three fifty. Everybody ready? Yup. We gotta wet our blisters. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll wet them for you. Okay. So what's gonna be our first step after we moisturize? So how how in depth do y'all want to do eyes? I'm trying to look like I got my makeup done by Pam. <laughs> That's impossible. <laughs> now I want to do like something with color, like what I was telling you, the under. Mm hmm So what color should I do? You have blood under red. red. Oh, my okay. Uggs is red. I would just grab a tiny little dot and put it on your hand. Here, I'm going to do it with y'all. Because we're going to carve out the brow and then prime the eye. Okay. So you guys have your concealer brush? You guys should have this one. Yeah, time. this one. Yeah. I'm trying to flatten your brush because you're gonna go under your brow, and this is where you guys you carve under your brow, like the shape that you want your brow. I think I need another close-up mirror. Mm -hmm. And now just bring it down and prep, prep the rest of your eyelid. Like add more? Mm hmm And do the whole eyelid? Yes. You're just creating like a barrier so that you don't go too high into your brow. So you guys know where to stop whenever you're doing your eyeshadow. And then you guys can grab that other concealer brush, the Real Techniques one, the more fluffy one. Mm -hmm. And then it just finish blending it out, like pat it. This one? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Good. And if you have creasing and stuff, you just use that brush to take away the creasing. And now we get to pick our eyeshadows. Do. Focus, you want to do like brown smoky at the top and then do a pop of color at the bottom yeah and everybody can do a different color mm-hmm okay. lunch break and we ain't even did nothing yeah we're taking a little lunch break we got the food sauce let me show you what it looks like oh you can see me yep 
We get the chicharron ones. Let me try it with that. I never tried it. What is it? Cabbage? Oh, yeah, this is cabbage. Mm, you got a vinegar smell. Let me try this. Don't you best. like how it was before, Tammy? What? You don't feel like it tastes different now? The repollo? Yeah. No, it's a different owner. I don't like it with well, the thing. No. I think the repollo tastes different now. Yeah. They don't make it spicy. Right? They used to have jalapenos. They don't do that no more. Well, I used to have jalapenos. They just probably put a little bit in there. I haven't had papusas in so long. They be busy as hell, though. Yeah, they be busy as hell. Yeah, they be busy as hell, though. Mm. Hot. It's hot right now. What's other types of Salvadorian food? Mmm. -hmm. <laughs> like, what else they sell in there? I don't know. Right, I just give a pusa. The um, chicharron de puerco, or the caldo chicharron de cerdo is good. It's just hot. It's yeah, hot as fuck. Well. Oh, my burn. My fingers are burning. Yeah, I'm about to stop because I don't like eating hot food. That was the best. Nah, I'm burning your down. Mm -mm. Oh, I can't eat hot food either. It gotta be steam coming out my food. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. My on does. Because I eat slow, so by the time I'm done, like, yeah. it's getting cold, so I need that as hot as possible. Mm -hmm. Can't be eating her food. Cold. I'm going to come back when we complicated. resume the makeup class. It's not. A medium tone brown, so I would do, like, burnt that's orange. You could even mix, like, these two together. Mm -hmm. But just not too dark. She like, that's yeah. too much. She going to get to you next? Like that or not? Yeah, that's fine. But, so whenever you pick up um, eyeshadow, I always just Welcome. tap and then... Okay. And where I'm starting it up. So you're gonna grab this brush again mm -hmm. because you had your eyes like open and close and stuff. So remember I told y'all that if, if you, you have creasing. You can blend the creases out. And now you're gonna go in. Where's your mirror? Oh, oh right. So right here, right here. Yes. I'm a, let me show you guys. Yeah. Let me see. Myself. I'm a. Um. I like visual. Yeah. Yeah, this is just your, your transition brown. shade. So you're starting to build your crease. Look, look in the mirror, you can see the difference between. You don't see this? Burl. So literally going like back and forth. Like mm -hmm. a rainbow. Mm -hmm. Choose a brown close to skin tone and rainbow. And then you can do circles too. I, I like to do circles right. Like that. Mm -hmm. And then in here, you can start blowing it up towards you. Right your, here? Mm -hmm. Like this? Yeah. And then for you, because you like to extend your eye, right? So if you want to extend it and make it more elongated, then with the same um, mm -hmm. brown, you're going to start feathering it out this way. Basically, you got to learn your face. like You got to know works, what, 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 what you want. What yeah. works for you. Because the mm -hmm. same stuff and might not work. She's been she doing is. that since she came out of the vagina. <laughs> I mean, she grew up around it, like with your mom yeah. doing all the beauty stuff. Well, that's stuff. how I got into beauty. And yeah, yeah so I would go with this one. Speed them up a little bit. Sit up, never like you know it. Put some black kids with the motor magic. We gon' sit up tight. Remember when I came up, I'm correct, all the bad bitches in my 
did a little smoky look and we did color correcting already and foundation with the brush and this is what it looks like so far this is what Lisbeth is looking like and then this is what Claudia looking like <laughs> Karen let me see Karen blending her concealer what's next the uh, contour yeah so placement is i like to hug the cheeks you see around the temples i try to like cup the cheek because if you don't put it in the right place contour makes it look worse off. yeah i'll put my contour down here you mean your brown my bronzer yeah, the bronze yeah. So I like to I like to start a little higher up because when you do start to blend it starts to disperse So if you already start here and you start blending it just starts mudding down towards the bottom of your face right there Yes, what's this called above the temple? right there? Yes Above the temple. No, this is on the cheekbone right Contour the cheekbone. above the cheekbone or mm -hmm. contour on the cheekbone on the cheekbone Right lower So when you blend try to so what is this Make sure for? Make blend high. I can blend This is to bring this. color back in your face, Bring huh? color and shape. Shape. Tap, 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 in. Because all you're trying to do is blend. You don't want it to disappear. Oh, know? okay. See, that's what I was doing. Trying to make it to disappear. No, because you, you don't, don't want the down, depth. Like, you want it to look. And so just focus said, it more in the back. Do you don't have up. to bring it so far forward. Because I did this one low. Right? Mm-hmm. But even if you do do a low, we can clean it up with um, the concealer. Trash. Oh, okay. Like, get some. Do 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 do. Turn on pound time off. How mods look? I feel like you can't see it. You gotta add more. Oh. <laughs> What's next? The forehead. Yeah. The same amount or like? Worse? I can see mine's now, Pam. Yeah, so you have to just um, keep building product because you don't want to go too dark. Yeah, I hate when it's dark. You, just, no. you never do right here? I do. I would just do no, like no. right there. Right here? Yeah, Which like a, 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 a cross right here. No, no, no. You got a lot? <laughs> <laughs> you so literally the place that you want to chisel the most just concentrate it right there this one look brighter mm -hmm. it on there. i think we need that nose, yeah, that nose brush we yeah need. we need that also, brush. yeah I'll show you the this number one. it's a morphe e62 yeah this i look better which one is this one the one you use yeah and the other one is the white one yeah this one is the one i got so you gotta go change it tomorrow so wipe the other one off said the moisturizer. <laughs> <laughs> <Ew>. <laughs> Why did you make your nose big? Bigger. Oh. Um, we do yeah, it up, down, go. up here. That one I would do with the brush. Okay. Like that, how you was on it? Karen over there stressing about Girl, that. Girl, she too. talking about I give up on this class. <laughs> what? She only did it. What's the day. jawline? This one the same? You do the jawline on me? Sometimes. What's no, the jawline down here? Your so face is already it. snatched. So I'm not doing it. I got a round, chubby face. Yeah, I'm so not like doing jawline. That looks complicated. That de it definitely pulled it back, though. Yes. And yet, when, she <laughs> did, when she just did your nose, I could see the difference. It made it smaller? Yeah. 
And it's not blended in. No, it's not blended in yet. So I could say. Just the outside, right? You don't gotta mm -hmm. go in the middle. All right, what's my next step? Blush. So blush, you wanna put, you wanna smile and put it on the apples of each cheeks. I don't gotta blush. I feel like the okay. brush is complicated for me for the now. Put that all the way down here with my mm -hmm. contour. That's where it go. Yeah, cause you want it to blend into each other. Well, so, I be right. seeing people do it all the way up here. Yeah, I like it over here because I've been doing. Okay, you want like, a C shape? And you I like, yeah, I like yeah. how it looks better. So over then, here. look at the top of your cheekbone, mm -hmm. like the very tops. Okay. Yeah. So then you're gonna one, two, three, because that's a C shape. Did you need it? Mm -hmm. I feel like I need Who more. You of this this up You don't want what am that? I doing? Tap, tap. <laughs> Why is that like so much? <laughs> Why you just have to keep tapping it. Or as well. It's okay. Right now with the concealer, it'll all clean up, I promise y'all. I don't do mine over here. I do mine right here. So why you didn't tell her? She do our makeup. She know what she doing. She did that one because that's the one I said I've been doing. That Where you do hard. yours at, Claudia? Yeah. Now I'm up. up here. Now around the edges. You do mine on my cheek. Yeah, do yours on your cheek. I mean, I'm carving the cheekbone. I don't know if I can do this part. It's a little hard. You just gotta see. make sure it match up. With I see. You can tell the difference, or it's just. Like you can kind of feel it too. Like you can kind, you can kind of feel your 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 bone structure. Uh -huh. So add it on the hand. Work the product. That's good. That's good, yeah. And, uh, yeah, yeah, you see? You do and it. stop right there? Or no, I would pull it all the way. To the lip? Yeah, like, like cup it up. Right there? Up. Like that. To the top of the lip. Because okay. you want to lift the face. Like that. Mm -hmm. And then blend it with the brush. I mean the... The sponge. We We're doing the regular tone though, right? Yeah, you're you're doing the regular tone. I'm just showing you guys placement. The one that's closest to your skin tone is the one that you guys are using right now. That's just how I like to work. Yeah. Because I don't like to put too much product on the face. Because if you go straight on, it just be a lot. You want to flatten your brush because you're going to go in patting. So, right under your lash line, you want to follow that line and just keep patting. And you I pull usually it just... Yeah, I'll just add it with the brush. But then you can get too much concealer. Mm. So we just tap in mm -hmm. all under. Mm -hmm. Right there. Like, if you look, the coverage is there right now. All we have to do is bring the brightness. And then when you get to the nose, you just are going to lay it down and then just follow the line that it creates. Mm -hmm. Carrie, you're done. How do you know when to stop yeah. tapping? Am I done? Carrie, you're not like, what yeah, I do you? <laughs> I don't like this one. I don't know what I do. Why are you even doing it? I did. It looks too out of my color.
y'all. So we are done with our makeup class, and this is our final looks. I look like I don't got nothing compared to y'all, cause I ain't do eyeshadow. Yeah, cause her lashes. Right, how we did for one to ten. All right, y'all. So I am back home from the makeup class, and I'm really loving the beat. Like I knew we was gonna do good, but I didn't think we was gonna eat like this. So I actually am trying out this little mic. So tell me how you guys like it. I had mentioned to you guys that I had a scams package that I wanted to show you guys. And since I'm glam, I was just like, why not try it on for y'all? So here are my packages. I'm really excited for this because it's the um, neon green collection that she did. And baby, I had to get all the pieces as you guys see. And then I also got some of her swimwear. I got one of the pieces and then this other set actually she got for me. I don't know if I'm gonna be trying to swimwear on cause y'all know how they like to do on here. So I'm definitely gonna try the green set on for you guys. Well, the green sets. But just in case you guys didn't get to see this set all the way, I'm gonna go ahead and show it to y'all. All right, so this is the crop top. I believe this is the logo one. As you guys see, it has like skims. And then these are the shorts, I believe. This is the cotton material, kind of giving me like the soft lounge. I'm not really sure, but these are the shorts. I really love how this looked on me today, especially with the um, shoes that I paired it with. So yeah, I get my bottoms in an extra small with skims and then I always get my tops in a small. Let's actually move on to these. This is the color that I'm actually really excited for. I'm gonna start off with the crop t-shirt. And then this one actually is the similar one to this blue one. Same detailing with the skims at the bottom. And I'm gonna probably pair it with the shorts as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and try that on now. All right, y'all, sorry, I'm new to this mic thing. The mic actually wasn't on for the last part I just showed y'all. But y'all, let's get into this color. Let's get into it. As you guys seen, and like I said, this is the Neon Green Collection. And to be specific, this is the Cotton Logo Super Crop T-shirt in Neon Green. And then these are the Cotton Ribbed Shorts. I feel like this color is just like so me and it's definitely giving it for like the spring. So this is what it's giving in the back the thing is thing boo if i really love it i just can't buy like one set or two like if i really love the color i have to get all pieces so if you're new to my channel i'm a pink girl for one and i'm also a green girl so yeah y'all know one thing about skims is gonna fit like a glove baby like it's just gonna fit um i do feel like sometimes i'll be wanting to size up on the bottoms because i get them in an extra small but I've actually have gotten small from skim and then like the crotch area is too baggy. So it's like you either going to be baggy or you're just going to be like fitted. And y'all know I love the fitted look. So that's why I always go with the extra small. But I do feel like sometimes it's a little too tight around my thighs because y'all know they a little juicy. All right. So I try to come back as far as I can. Next up that I'm trying on for you guys is the neon green leggings and then this is the tank like i said you can pretty much mix and match all of these pieces together and you know make different outfits with the same pieces and i really love that me personally i love the leggings more i don't know why i feel like maybe because they are not like so tight on my thighs so just a little close up you know she has like that boxer detail with like the skims logo right here on the front and then the tank top is pretty much just plain and like i see it's hugging the body honestly y'all don't even know if i'm putting this mic like real close to my mouth enough for y'all to actually hear me let me know if it sounds better or what it's giving so next up the only different that i'm gonna be changing is my tops this is the cotton jersey tank. I like this top because I feel like it gives like a little more coverage than from like the bralette and the actual tank. And this one actually is just pretty solid. Um, it doesn't really have like the ribbed detail like the other pieces. And I really just love how it looks. I feel like this is a pretty good shirt for like a basic kind of shirt to dress up. It fits very nicely. 
and it is like a very good length as you guys see and actually i've been seeing some girls actually tuck their shirts in i guess to actually show off like the skims right here in the front so lastly i'm gonna try on the bralette and i did size up in a bralette to a medium just for a little more coverage i feel like the small does fit me a little tight so we're gonna try this on and see what it's giving all right so this is the bralette and the medium definitely fits better for sure so i'm gonna start sizing up because i feel like with the small they're looking more so like this as you guys see it's definitely more coverage and the waist definitely fits more loose and i actually clipped it on the second to last one so i can still actually clip on the last one and feel a little more you know loose let me put y'all a little down this is what it looks like full length with the leggings i feel like the bralette goes perfect with the leggings because it's like you're covered but sexy at the same time so i really love this together all right so moving on to swim this is the one that i got for myself it's the metallic swim halter monokini the color nickel i got this in a small this just gave it to me i actually missed out on her first swim collection so when i seen she was dropping again i just needed to grab me one so i really love how right here in the front it actually says skim and as you guys see the body is gonna be out like the sides it's in this pretty like metallic color Hopefully I got my right size because like I said, this is my first time ordering from the swim collection. So next up, this is what she got me is the metallic swim, the bikini bottom, and the color dragon fruit. I really didn't even know he was going to give me this. It really caught me by surprise. I really was going to go with this one for myself when I got the bodysuit one because it's supposed to be like the pink color, but I kind of felt like it was giving me more like purple. Actually looking at it in person, I feel like it's still giving me purple, but I really like it. So it's the same like little metallic color or whatever. So you will tie the drawstrings right here on the side. So he actually got me the triangle bikini top as well. He got me both of these in a size small. So this is what this looks like. Y'all know I'm part of the itty bitty titty committee, so this is gonna look perfect and just looks so cute. So I'm actually really excited to be wearing these. Well, not soon, but soon. So not only that, but he actually he actually got me this other one that's actually pink. This is the bandage one, I believe. Let me see. No, it's the knit swim strappy bikini bottom, the color magenta. This is the bottoms. And as you guys see, it has like this crisscross straps right here in the front. And the sides will basically be poking right here. I feel like this one has a little more coverage than the other one. But I'm guessing because the other one is more so like bikini look. But this material is real thick compared to the other one. So I like that about this. And that's actually inside small as well. And y'all, as I'm realizing my mic is not even on again because i actually had to plug it in my phone so i have to like press start on my phone instead of like plugging into my camera so i need to look for the actual piece for me to allow me to plug it in my camera so you know i won't have like that much confusing going on this is the pretty much the same you know description has that same like strappy look going on and like i said this material is very very thick and it actually has like good stretch and definitely more coverage right here in the boob part i really love this color as you guys can see it's actually pink he just wanted to give me i guess the pink collection because this one and the metallic swim actually dropped together so i'm really excited to see how these are actually going to look on me because i feel like this is a little more different from my style but i'm excited to see how it's gonna look so yeah that is all my pieces for this little skims try on or whatever so actually i had picked up some food on the way home i got some chinese food so i'm actually just about to eat that and i guess change into something um i really don't even want to take this makeup off but i'm gonna probably take it off because i'm really just obsessed with it i can't believe we 
actually did this good but i'm ready to see like how it's gonna look and what it's actually gonna give like when i get to do it like by myself without pam so i'm really excited for that so i'm gonna come back and show you guys my food all right y'all so i changed my clothes and i'm about to eat this is the food shrimp with mixed vegetables and then i'm actually gonna try these pink cokes that um karen got me like two weeks ago but i have yet to try them it doesn't really say a flavor it just says transformation flavored so i'm gonna see what it's giving but i really just wanted it because it was like pink and it's actually a collab with um rosalia so let's open it and i'm gonna put it on some ice mm -hmm. Oh, I should have put the mic on it for y'all. Chi already tried it. He said it kind of has like a strawberry taste to him, like strawberry and cherry. It's not giving me strawberry. It's giving me like cream, like real sweet. So it actually says it has caramel and caramel color. I think that's the taste. So I have my chili oil. I can't eat no Chinese without this. Mm, that's best to move my mouth. I'm about to F this up. It's spicy to that. I'm about to just eat my food. It's spicy. Hey y'all, uh, so I'm probably looking crazy. I took glam off, sadly. And I'm about to just go to sleep and go at night. But I just wanted to update you guys. Today was a very good and productive Sunday. So, good night y'all. Let's get it. I bought for 16 passenger. This is G5. No, this not a challenger. Big one. I keep some members with me in the fridge. The coat seats. They some cannibals. Eat us. They like the geek geek. Drink a whole bottle. Wake up and repeat. Damn. She took a look. Mixed it with the chill out. Now she says she's saying 3D. Wow. I go in the jungle and they got a coat. I bet I come out with a me. I bet I do this shit for the fam. Cause this shit bigger than me. Big. Color stones in my infinity link. And in the factory masterpiece. Mystery. I call him twin. Could that be my brother? We got the same roller. He matching me. Nah. For real, water on me like the sun of sun, carrot, sun, pointers, all these commas, I won't fun, fun, me go gunners out the junk, we buy it all, fuck a front, fuck nigga, cake on me, no fun, who cares, drop top, feeling like stunner, drop top, can't be play, no runner, we gon' chrome my wallet, smoke my pilot, take three vibes to the trappers, trap it, nigga, one shit, shit, I was outside just serving narcotics, narcotics, woo, pay me that stick, nigga made one wrong move, just popping, pop, living on broke with the whole fed it out in the hotel lot. It's crowded. Diamonds be dancing like Bob. They dance. Don't touch a dick like if you cock. Don't touch. Shroom and G sit the party. We geek. Bitches gon' trend on the top. Keep trend. The way I pull up, I'ma pop it and none of these niggas gon' stop me. Pull up. Gone. Put that shit on. Get a cup for the drip. I'm on motherfucking five kilos. Good morning, guys. I am back from the gym so today it's tuesday i'm eating some bagels with cream cheese the other day i actually forgot to show y'all my new makeup bag so i'm gonna actually get to that today and i'm pretty much about to clean up a little bit since sunday i didn't get to do that and we've been doing like a lot of takeout so literally looks like crazy but i'm not gonna show you guys that and like i mentioned we've been doing a lot of takeouts today i actually want to cook i took out some chicken wings so maybe like baked chicken y'all know the usual um i tried this fried cabbage recipe and it was like perfect so i'm gonna retry to do that again so i'm gonna have to go out to the grocery store to grab on the few things that we need that's pretty much gonna be the agenda so after i do a little bit of that and refreshing up i'll probably come back and talk to you guys hey guys so it's actually much later just got done doing a bit cleaning up i refreshing up and did these two little braids but instead of going out to the store which i don't feel like doing i'm just gonna instacart the things that i need and then that way i can you know finish catching up on laundry while i wait and i actually been catching up on some work too i needed like to pick out some new things from sheen you guys see i picked out like a few new items i also need to do stuff for my um haul that i recorded and i'm most likely gonna drop it tomorrow so i need to do stuff like for my description and that's pretty much it i'm just gonna wait on the groceries to get here all right y'all so as you guys see i've been folding 
to Zona's clothes. And I've just been watching Creed. And actually my Instacart order got delivered not too long ago. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this clothes up and then just wait on the next loads. And then I guess I'm gonna get started on dinner. All right, y'all, I'm in the kitchen. I already put my chicken in the oven and I already cut up the sausage that's going in the cabbage the veggies and i'm cutting up the cabbage now as you guys see i like to cut it like very thin so i'm just cutting this up and i'm actually watching creed 2 now i might pour me up some little wine Excuse the loud air, but this is what the veggies look like. Just let them saute for about two or three minutes, and I'm gonna go ahead and add the cabbage now. What I'm sipping on, I had some from the other day. This is the 19 Cross Cali Red by Snoop Dogg. Karen put me on to this one. And I'm gonna be mixing it with some Stella Rose, the Black Cherry. So this one, y'all, it gets y'all to the point, but it's nasty, it's like bitter. I, I don't like that. So that's why I mix it with the Stella, because y'all know the Stella is very sweet, but I feel like the Stella isn't like necessarily strong, like a strong wine. And I feel like it's like the perfect pair. Cheers. It's perfect. All right, y'all, so I went ahead and seasoned it. I'm gonna list the seasonings that I use for this. And then it's already done and I'm gonna go ahead and add the sausages to it and give it a good little mix. I went ahead and mixed it in and I lowered the heat down to like two. So I cook it on like a medium seven and then I just let it sit just so the cabbage can get a little softer but it's pretty much done. And y'all cannot tell me that right there does not look good. Laundry time. The first time I'm going to tell it. Please. You're a Philly girl. Yeah, I guess, but it'd be nice to have more space. And your mom's out there. And, and the labels, too. Can help me get my music out to more people. And I feel like I've done everything I could in Philly. No. Time exactly what I said. You know? What about Rocky? Alright, y'all. I'm gonna show you guys my new makeup bag that I got. Like I promised y'all, I filled that cup of wine. And I actually just took the baked chicken out of the oven and my sweet potatoes. So basically my dinner is done, but she's going to make rice for him and Tizana. So this is my like everyday makeup bag that I got from Target. This is the new one. As you guys see, it's pink. 
So then you gotta like unzip it. And it's not just a regular makeup bag, of course. It has a mirror. And not just a mirror, it's lighted as well. So, it's kind of like a traveling makeup bag. So, you know, it has like different light settings as you guys seen. This one came with this pad that is for like brushes. It also came with this other case that I think is for like jewelry. And then the actual case has like these dividers and you can actually take these out and you know organize it and divide it however you like. So yeah, that's what that looks like. And I believe this is actually supposed to be like rechargeable. So it has like the cord for that. I'm thinking if I should transfer my things in here or if I should just like keep it in here and just use this when I'm like actually going somewhere and I need to do like my makeup on the go or i'm guessing like when i'm traveling but after this i'm gonna fix my food and eat all right so this is what it looks like and it looks like your girl needs some more products in here because this is looking a little dry and then i have my brushes right here so it will go on the top like that and then you know we will zip it back up like this i will definitely have this link down below for you guys because this is definitely a vibe like i just love this i love the whole look to it all right y'all the food is ready and excuse the music she's taking a shower now he's showering to zana so they're having a whole concert but i'm about to eat i'm gonna give you an overview we got the baked potato i added butter and brown sugar baked chicken with carrots and onions then we got the cabbage so this is my plate and i'm about to eat i'm gonna give y'all a little taste try. i'm gonna try the cabbage Busting like the first time. I need to get some hot sauce for my chicken. Let me try this sweet potato. I never tried it with adding brown sugar. Mm -hmm. It's like sweeter. And my baked chicken go here every time, baby. So I need to try that. So I might just eat my food, y'all. I can't really talk to y'all because of the music. As you guys hear, so good night, y'all. Hey guys, so I got back from workout and I fixed up some breakfast. As you guys see, some pancakes, eggs, and sausage. Yeah, this is busting. Y'all need to try them pancakes like I told y'all, adding the walnuts. This time I didn't add strawberries or bananas because I ain't had none, but it's still perfect. So I'm about to eat this and then refreshing up and then come back and talk to you guys and let y'all know a little bit about my day or whatever. Hey y'all, so I came out I took my braids out as you guys see the hair is looking cute and crinkly and I'm actually headed to my mailbox place slash like PO box because I think my YouTube plaque got delivered so I'm coming to pick it up and then whatever other packages or mail that we have here and I actually want to like you know unbox it with you guys I'm so excited to see it and then I actually want to announce like my giveaway winner so that's what I'm about to do now. I forgot I had to say these. Are you waiting on me or am I waiting on you? You waiting on your codes to load I'm in? I'm waiting on you too. Oh, she, well, you ain't uh, look out, girl, <laughs> dang. I was picking up my mail, but I was looking for these. So. You can scan this one. Mm, it should be able to. Let's see what it does. So it's here. 
We got all this other mail. Nothing but BU. I'm about to just ship these stuff off. It's like some things that I want to put pretty little thing that didn't fit me. So I'm gonna get this situated, y'all, and then probably check back in once I get back to my casa. Alright, y'all, so I am in Bad Tammy's headquarters, aka my office, with this package and a cup of wine. So like I mentioned, I wanted to do the honors of opening my plaque with you guys. Let me do the reveal with y'all. Wow. <laughs> there she go. So they sent this little card and it says congratulations on your subscriber milestone and then it just says like if it was damaged and all that it has like an email for you to reach them at it also has this letter from youtube it says do you remember your first subscriber your hundredth or your a thousandth subscriber chances are you do and we know that you'll definitely remember your a hundred thousandth subscriber your fans may have found you while searching YouTube, learned about you through a friend, or maybe you showed up as a recommended video. No, but no matter how they came to your channel, fans stayed and their numbers increased because of your unique voice and the excitement of being a part of the growing community that you established. We are thrilled to see the development of your community and we are proud to honor your impressive milestone of reaching 100,000 subscribers with with the silver creator award congratulations we know that you have many more stories to share with your community and we know that your fans can't wait for you to engage and amaze them even more with your commitment and creativity so keep creating keep building we can't wait to see what you'll do next and we're here to support you along the way and who knows when you reach your millionth subscriber we may just write you to ask you do you remember your 100,000 subscriber you're sincerely susan basically like the ceo of youtube this is actually so sweet and i feel like it's actually like really like heartwarming like yeah no i'm not really like a crybaby or really like a big like emotional person but that was like really sweet and i'm just like really still excited and just very appreciative of this moment like i'm actually you know getting basically awarded for doing something that i truly enjoy doing so this is what she looks like y'all and it just says presented to bad tammy for passing 100,000 subscribers and y'all know she is gonna go in my office so i need to see where i want to put her but like i was saying like it just feels so nice to actually be doing something that i like love and i feel like i'm like getting really good at like with the edits not even that just being like authentically like myself like just tammy like besides from like the bad tammy like baddest and all that like just tammy it just feels good to be honest y'all like i said i'm not really like a big emotional girl i don't really like to talk about my feelings but i just you know want to put that to the side and just say you know thank you again to you guys so i know i had mentioned that i wanted to do a 100k subscriber um giveaway because it would just be right so i believe my last video you guys just had to you know comment why you subscribe to my channel or how did you find my channel basically and to you know drop your instagram so therefore i can reach you so basically a lot of you guys said so many like sweet things but plenty of y'all didn't leave like your instagram so it's like nowhere for me to like contact you and i don't want to like you know comment like oh you won because i know it is an account that comments under like my comments from telegram saying like oh you won reach me at telegram which i'm letting you guys know like that's not me so don't fall for it i'll probably insert her matter of fact i'm gonna read her because this is the winner so basically the gift is i'm gonna be making like a pink basket for her Y'all know I'm a pink girl. Y'all know I love, like, you know, doing my own things. Very hands-on with a lot of my things on my channel. So, you know, I'm just going to put together a little, like, thank you basket for her. So, she's the winner, like I said. And I'm going to read her comment. So, let's take a sip before we start. She said, hi, Tammy. I first off want to say congrats on 100K. It is hard work for and well-deserved. May God keep blessing 
you all to win nonetheless i started watching you about two years ago two years ago i was at my saddest and my lowest i moved away from my family and had a son in which he's all i have watching you gave me some type of home watching you grow with tizana and i grow with my son watching you diy everything when you don't have to unlike us that have no choice the way you think of mind over matter my emotions are my downfall and to see how you carry yourself made me realize it's okay to not have expectations of others you show that grind is real and i appreciate your content the rawness of being a mom girlfriend sister and everything else that you carry her comment just like really stood out to me maybe i read like three or four other ones that i felt like were probably like my top faves so here's another one i was on facetime with my latino friend and she flipped the camera i said who is that she's hella pretty and that's her baby oh my gosh she's so adorable i asked for your youtube name and she started to tell me that you have sisters so i subscribed to them also i watched a video with her and i loved your energy there are not many youtubers who show as much energy as you do you always make sure that we are everywhere that you are and i love that i love that you include baby girl in everything that you do and that's what you call an amazing mommy i love how you go that extra mile for your family and not think twice about it i love how i love how much you show love to tunchi even though we rarely see him we see enough you have gotten amazing and showing your life and i know being a youtube is not for the week congratulations on being the baddest you deserve everything good that's flowing your way continue to be you i love you and will continue to support you always i screenshotted the ones that i'm reading and i think i chopped off her name but i think it kind of said something vibe with ty okay and the next one is from amaya the main reason i joined your channel was because you're a mom obviously and i just really loved how attentive and how you go all out for your loved ones but mainly your daughter seeing you a lot on honest channel made me sit and binge and binge your whole channel because you're so admiring as a mother and influencer it's amazing to see how when tizana gets older she'll be able to look back and see how dope her mama is period as she would say if anyone deserves 100k it's you seeing all the hard work and overachieving work you do from doing bomb decor and hair to being there for your family and spoiling with things that are super meaningful thank you for being a light to me and helping me out of certain depressive statuses you and your family are blessings and she also said can't wait to see skin sponsor y'all speaking it into existence this one is from alicia and this one is like long y'all so this is my last one and then we gonna go by our day says i subscribed because i saw you on nana's channel so i follow all the sisters but i went to your very first video and started being watching all your videos and what made me continue to watch was you honestly can't give another answer i don't even want to win but i feel like you should hear from your supporters on how you have an impact you remind me of my older sister so creative loving caring but don't take no shit you're a great mommy and baby she be having me tickled saying mommy then tammy when she's getting serious i also love the color pink and your diys are so expiring i love the family get togethers for literally any and everything because me and my family are tight like that as well your relationship with your father is private yet the love is clearly shown just like it is with mama estrella the love for your sisters go hard i know you will drop anything to come to each other's side you'll stay late to help them and even lose sleep all of y'all are like that based on what i've seen keep it up you are beautiful smart talented and definitely god gifted a personality like yours and your sisters is rare my notifications will forever stay on proud of you so with that being said i just want to say thank you to each and every one of you guys that are like real supporters like real genuine supporters that you know just want to see a bitch win so i'm about to just finish sipping on my wine and i'm actually gonna sit outside because it's actually a good day with tazana she wants to like you know go outside and play so i might you know bring my laptop outside and you know just do a little bit of work while she gets her energy out or whatever so that's pretty much what i'm gonna do so yeah i'll probably come back and update you guys a little later Mona Lisa, break a nigga in the pieces. Had to egg some cheesy niggas out my circle like a pizza. I'm way too.
who was crucified. Shop on Mr. Booty, saw the little ass clothes, only fit fake booties. Yeah. Bad bitch, still talking cash shit. Pussy like water, I'm a mother and relaxing. I would never trip on a nigga if I had him. That's my trash, you the maid, so you bag him. I'm a savage. Classic, bougie, ratchet. Sassy, moody, nasty. Hacking, stupid. Good morning, guys. So as you guys see, we are up about to hit the gym but my um my workout outfit is giving like i'm going to the club i think i got this in old navy it was on sale and i just you know i thought it was like the print was a little different but it's giving like i'm going to the club it's like all shiny and stuff but yeah today is thursday which means this is my last day at the gym i only come tuesday through thursday so i'm actually like two three minutes from the gym and i'll just check with you guys once i arrive Trudy, what you say about my outfit I'm like, you going to the damn club. <laughs> That's literally what I said. <laughs> later and we are chilling outside i actually been doing a little bit of editing but i just went and got some food for us so we got this little picnic blanket and we got some popeyes i got the black and tenders and mashed potatoes the sweet heat and i'm currently just gonna try to watch something since i'm gonna eat i can't really edit but yeah for some reason y'all girl like being outside i'm actually gonna watch harlem on um, amazon video I'm on season two and these black contenders are good like if you're on a diet or like working out and now that I think about it y'all I ordered that strawberry biscuit because I wanted to try it and they ain't even put it so I'm about to watch this and I guess update y'all a little later all right, y'all, quick update. Your girl's still outside editing. Zana's finally sitting down, eating a little snack. Look how dirty she look, y'all. So filled. She ended up falling. So now she want to sit down and eat a snack. That's how we used to be back in the day. We literally used to spend all our days outside. So that's kind of why I do it, because I know like that's what we used to love doing. And you don't really see like you know little kids wanting to play outside no more. They just be wanting to be on their phone. But it actually like it's about to start raining. So we're gonna go inside in a minute. And hopefully our meat is unthawed by now. Cause I took some meat out to cook dinner. Cause literally look at this guy. It's actually like lightning and thundering already. So you heard that. So this is the weather as you guys can see. It's about to get real ugly out here. So I'm about to just keep editing y'all and I'll probably come update y'all once we get started on dinner.
Hey guys, so it's much later and I am in bed as you guys see. It did start raining and like real bad after I had mentioned it to you guys. So I just got finished on some internet and I started back watching Harlem. So that's what I'm still doing right now. And then actually Chi made dinner. I'm just waiting on that. He said it's about like five to ten more minutes. I actually showed you guys a little bit of that. Not too much since he was cooking and I'm just like trying to lay down, relax, and you know, watch my show. Alright, y'all. So she just fixed my plate and we got teriyaki steak, a sweet potato, and green beans. One of my favorite steak. The sweet potato and Steak combo. Perfect. Mm. Alright, I'm gonna to keep watching my show. Hey guys, so today is Saturday. A rainy Saturday at that. And I am currently on the way to the grocery store to meet up my dudes. And I'm actually gonna go pick Nana up. Because we are picking up some items that we need for my mom's birthday that's coming up. And I also need to get something for us to eat. And today I actually wanted to do either cook dinner, something different, and you know, vibe out with a little drink or something since it is Saturday night. Or I either wanted to do like some Easter baskets for the kids because Easter is actually tomorrow. So now that I think about it, I do need to pick up on some eggs. But y'all know my baby is just a one kid crew, so don't need to really grab too much. Her cousin is gone for the weekend, and originally we didn't have any Easter plans. So let's see what we do. But anyways, like I said, I am on the way to meet up with everybody. So I will probably check in with you guys. Alright y'all, there's all the things we grabbed. I ain't really sure because y'all done came to Sam's Club with us a lot of times. Drinks, plates. I think I'm gonna make some lamb chops for dinner later, so I grab these onions and all that. More drinks. The birthday girl right here. The ready for the birthday. Yay! <laughs> hey y'all, so I am home. So I stopped by to get us some food when I left from Sam's Club. It was the Chick Fil A right there. I'm trying out the Cobb salad with grilled nuggets. And I don't know if you guys been seeing that they came out with this new um, watermelon flavor. So I'm trying it out. I got the watermelon lemonade. Yeah, this is good. It's watermelon mint. Yep. And I'm trying to think what I want to cook. I know I grabbed lamb chops. Like I'm going to maybe get on TikTok and look some recipes up. I did taste. Mm -hmm. Good pretty good i don't think i like it better than the spicy one though so i'm about to keep looking at these recipes y'all so i'm gonna need to go back out and grab the things that i need because i didn't even grab anything for us to like drink on i might be on the wine bob again but anyways i'm gonna just come back and update you guys on that later What's poppin'? Oh, Brand new whip just hopped in. I got options. I can pass that bitch like Stockton. Just joshin'. I'm spendin' this holiday locked in. My body got rid of them toxins. Sports in the top ten. I can put the ball in it. Hey guys, we are back from Walmart. We picked up on a few of Easter things. I'm about to fill these eggs up real quick. Cause Susanna is actually sweet. And we did get some baskets. But we didn't get to find many things to put inside the basket. So. This is literally the few little things we got to find. And then we literally just got to find these candies. I'm about to fill up these little bit of eggs. I'm probably going to try to go to the store tomorrow. Maybe like Target, Five and Below. So that's what I'm about to be doing. And I actually feel like tired, so I'm not going to cook. We probably just gonna cook tomorrow. Well, we are for like you know Easter or whatever. So I'm about to just be filling up these little eggs for my baby. We also picked out these other like custom eggs that have like these characters. Oh, 
Benzo. Me and my amigos got that free smoke on the West Coast. Yeah, I'm talking about pre rolls Dark hair bitch, she look like she go. She do. Hometown hero, feeling myself, can't murder my ego. She heard of my deep stroke, she said, babe, does it hurt when I deep throw? Certified free ho, hang around does and she learned my lingo. Back then, wasn't worried about me though. In the gym, trying to work on my free throw. Goddamn. Goddamn. Spending money at the club like Sam. Yes, ma'am. She a little freak on cam. She don't put this on the ground. Little boys trying to dance on the ground. I can't switch on the fan. Shit's hot, hit the switch on the fan. This where my head is. I feel resentment from every direction. Even some homies be wearing expressions. I be discouraged from sharing my blessings. We used to share a connection. Now it just feels like it's wearing and stretching. I'm getting real sick of taking advice from people that never could spare reflections. All right, y'all, so I am done with all these eggs. And then these that were left over, I think I'm going to try to put some dollars in there. But these are pretty much done and filled with candy. So I'm going to go ahead and put these up and try to hide them somewhere. Because if she finds these in the morning, she will eat them up. Hey, guys. It's the next day, and today is Easter. So happy Easter to you guys. So your girl is all glammed up and dressed and ready for the day i just threw on my green skins because you know it's like an easter color and i'm pretty much just chilling since your girl is like so last minute with our plans that we have so we actually just got back from making store runs from picking up like meat because we're grilling you know we love grilling for any occasion and i did try to stop at a few stores to get more things for the baskets a lot of stores were closed i didn't know that so i would just try to put together whatever i can with whatever i have but pretty much the only one that's gonna get it is tazana which you know she been to the stores with me so she kind of already know what we got so i'm gonna put the little baskets together re really quick because then i want to go ahead and maybe set up like a little picnic vibe outside for us because we are going to be outside and hide the eggs for her so she can go ahead and you know find her eggs and all that get her little easter vibe going actually this morning as well i had put together some things that i had took out from like storage that we have i know i'll be telling y'all that she has like a lot of things that she still has yet to open from like birthdays and just holidays period so i opened this new like trampoline that she got gifted some paw patrol scooter and then like this little atv so she has little things to play with while we're outside so right now i'm about to go ahead and just get started on the little baskets so i'm gonna start off by putting this um fake grass this match my nose and this is spreading it out so this is the basket i found for Susanna, and then this is the one for jk and then this is just the other one that we got for um cheese daughter and then since i'm probably not gonna see kale till like during the week i probably might end up like going to a store to upgrade his basket before i take it um to him all right so this is what they look like with that and i didn't really get to find much like i said for mostly like jk like boy stuff so I'm gonna definitely have to get go get him some things. I got to find this like little toy. So I'm gonna put that in there. I know his mom told me he does love peeps. So y'all yeah, know that's like an Easter candy. I got to find this Spider-Man activity set. So I'm gonna put that in there. I also got him this like skateboard little toy. So that's really all I got to find for him. So I'm gonna definitely have to run to the store um, tomorrow and upgrade that for him before I give it to him. So then I got purple for this basket and then she actually picked this one out for her. So I'm put that in there. He also picked this one out for her as well. Along with this one. Then I picked this one out cause I know she loves like poppets and I think this can go like on a drink. So I got that right there for her. And then I think I'm gonna actually put like a few eggs in here since she's like not gonna do the egg hunt with us. So I'm gonna put a few eggs in here. And then I know I told y'all that I was gonna do some money ones. Actually, y'all know my sister Nana always gives like the money for the egg hunt. So she had sent me a hundred dollars, but I didn't cash it all out. And then for Tizana, I got this like bubble machine, even though I actually had just found this baby shark one that I had bought for her like years ago. So I'm actually gonna have, I'm actually gonna plug that one up and use it. Then I have like this egg racer and Minnie Mouse. All this stuff is just last minute things I got to find y'all. I got her the pink peeps. I got the same activity one like Kale, but I got her this LOL one. She pretty much likes, you know, all the characters, so she's fine with that. Um, I got her this Barbie egg. 
I got her this like peeps. It's like um it says play-doh, I think. Play-doh or slime, one of those. And then I got to find her like these little small Barbie things. This is like a Barbie outfit. This is like accessories, and then this one is like a bunny. So I'm put these in here. Then I also got her this other little like LOL ball. All right, so then this is what Tazana looks like. So the, just a little overview of what the baskets look like. But of course I said I was going to add extra eggs and like the money eggs. Then this is Tazana's. And then this is JK's. These are my little last minute basket for the kids. As you guys seen, Tazana already did her egg hunt. And she just sitting over here eating all this candy up. It's a little chilly, so she changed her outfit. But she's only going to get to eat like two more candies. Because she's going to have to eat. And then y'all know her stomach going to be hurting. But I finally poured up my wine. And I'm about to start sipping. Because the day is complete. Happy Easter. <laughs> y'all, I'm really, I'm really a mother out here. Like... I'm really like doing this. <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah, for me. Hmm? For me. Yeah, for you. She just started grilling, so I'm actually about to go up there and steal me a little meat because I'm hungry. Okay, we here. We haven't ate nothing. Ma, I'm over. I have four more eggs, and that's going to be enough. Nana just pulled up and brought Tazana in a little basket. It's for me and Zay. Yeah. Nana and Zay. It's Minnie Mouse. Oh, they got her these. Yeah, Minnie Mouse vibe. Oh, that's cute. Bubbles. We've been on the bubbles vibe today. I can focus counting this cake. Skating my pocket down shape. We're about to do some little chalk artwork with these egg shaped chalks. These are so cute. Yeah, it's like in an egg carton. Yeah, it looks it look like eggs are open. <laughs> I literally used to put All right, eggs. Is that red or pink? That's red. <laughs> I want red. I'm about to do green. And I'm, I'm going to pick. What you gonna pick? Is it red or pink though? This is red. pink. I'm it's supposed pick. to be red. Well, it probably is pink. No, I don't want it because it's not red. <laughs> I'm gonna pick it. I'm gonna do purple. Uh, because it's pink. <laughs> all right, what you gonna do, Tazana? Do? Let's do all these ones. She's just gonna do a whole bunch of nothing. What I'm gonna do? All right, what you gonna do? Girl, what is she doing? She's literally just going all the way down the driveway. You gonna do a square? Like, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna just write a whole bunch of stuff in my square. Oh, that would be cute. Like, everybody got yeah, their square. Yeah, square. Hold on. Let me see. Let me do your square. So, we're gonna do a little squares. I think they be doing this like some people that graduate. Yeah, I seen that. Like in the um, park. So this is on a square. Here. This is my square. Draw right here. Only in your square. No, only draw the line. <laughs> she gonna write in everybody else's square. That That's Tammy good. Square. Okay, I'm doing this. I think I'm gonna no, spell no, out. No, no. Like Easter or something. Tiny, you all in my way. Yo, he already big. You gonna have to do everything lower. <laughs> my mom and I answered the chalk chat. 
Okay, sign your key. And my auntie entered the chop oh, chat too. Good. I'm a uh, <laughs> Con Jasir es la Z. El la S es Z. Aquí? Donde está la S? Ajá, es Z. But I only have pink. What am I doing? You can get any color you want. Star shaped flower. No, no, what you doing? The world. Water and the sun. Yeah. Yeah, water and the sun. Water and the sun. What does Anna got? Oh, that's so cute. See? My aunt put Jazir's name. And she needs to spell it. And she ain't spell it right. Damn, I was trying to do Easter, but I think I did. You did your E too big. I always start my letter off big. You should have did a lowercase. It's not going to fit. Or you going to make it do what it do? Nico, that's wrong. 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 She's copying me, bro. Look, she's copying me. She's doing the water. Tazana. Uh, she did the water. Yeah, I'm not gonna have to bring it down. Bruh. What is this? I don't <laughs> Look at your mom's hand. <laughs> Tazana, why are you copy me? Because I want to. <laughs> mom, wow. yeah. Girl, that's like East ER. I put East 323. Yeah. And what you gonna add, like some type of other color on top? Yeah, like I'm probably this is designed. Did I put Easter? Bro, she put OTC Australia. <laughs> Easter 23. Updates on everybody. Blocks. Tammy done went full. Art teacher, arts and craft. <laughs> and pimped now. it out. Yeah, it look like Easter. Easter 23. Tammy did some fishes for me. I put my name. Tazana got her name and her heart. She got a son. She did water. My aunt put her, her whole family name. Yeah, she put it all her. Jazir, Jonah, Jay, Sherlyn, and her, her husband. husband, and then her initials. Zay just joined. My mama got a lot going on. OTC Australia. Who? Who? I ain't doing No, all Tazana did it, so they thought it was a line. <laughs> She put Pedro and Estrella. Like, Ay, it's giving ustedes. middle school couple. It's like Nana too. Oh, I didn't even see. Chaparro. They was just tagging they family. <laughs> just tagging. Now Pedro is doing his little block. Tazana actually was helping him with that stuff, that son over there. And he did like a face on it. And Tazana just want to keep talking and talking. That's cute. He doing like a whole bubble letter. That's cute. I'm gonna show y'all Pedro's when he's done. All right, y'all Pedro's is done. I think he just did his initials, and then this is Chi. Dang, all that spraying you doing? That's all you gonna do? You talking about spraying? This ain't spraying. This why you supposed to show your artistic gene? He just wrote Happy Easter with a heart. Is it supposed to be some eggs? Yeah. And then Claudia is starting hers. She just pulled up with Karen. Come on, Pedro. Okay, are you already done? That's all you're gonna do? I haven't even showed y'all food, but she is already done. He's just doing the lamb chops. I just did one pack and chorizo. I'm gonna show y'all the other food in the house. All right, so this is the other food that's already done. We got the chicken and the beef ribs. My mom actually made some um, sopa fria for us as like a side. Basically like cold pasta. And then she also picked up some rice for us. And some beans. And I did get some salsa earlier from where we had got the meat. Because I damn sure wasn't going to make any salsa. So I got both green and red salsa. Cheers. Cheers. Switching the box to Henny. Cheers. Cheers! And look, I braided um J hair. Are you okay? 
<laughs> this the last little battle. Uh, uh, I thought we was on a little wine, babe. They want the liquor. Yeah. We were nothing to glory. I ain't telling y'all to do it. I'm just telling my story. I was in the and chill and make bangers. Cause you ain't on the bitch. That's what it sound like. Whole life been through some fucked up shit. X unto this. When you see what I see, you end up like this. In the mirror side, we gon' win. Knock me down nine times, but I get up ten. See a copy every look. I got a few dollars. Every check I deposit got a few comments. Hey guys, so it's been a little later since everybody left So I just really just wanted to come say goodnight and actually close this video out So yeah guys, this is the end of this video I hope you guys really enjoyed your Easter with your family and kids Hope you guys had a, a good week overall So yeah, I will see you guys in my next video Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and do all that good stuff Follow me on Instagram and with all that being said I will see you guys in my next video bye